Another big misconception in learning relativity is time dilation and gravitational time dilation. What is that? Well, I want you to think time dilation and something as a light clock. So the light clock goes up and down, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. A light reflects at the front of the mirror and it, it reflects the back. So each tick and tock makes one cycle. You can think of it as a second. Now time dilation in special theory of relativity happens because of speed or velocity or things which are moving close to the speed of light. So if you take that tick tock clock and if you move faster, you will see that light or the line which was going up and down will now start moving in a diagonal manner. So if this diagonal manner is further extended and if it is further extended you will say you will see that this tick happens over here and then the talk happens over there. And if you move faster close to the speed of light you will see this tick is happening over there and this talk is happening much later. So this diagonal line actually shows that there is a time dilation. But here is a misconception. This time dilation happens in two frames of reference. If I am moving with a light clock, then the time will be moving exactly in the same in the same speed. That means my wristwatch will happening that tick tock perfectly. But you who is watching that tick tock clock moving close to the speed of light, you will see a, see a tick over here and then going round there is a tock over there. So time dilation is basically something like this. You get a tick tock which happens a tick over there and the tock happening over there. So this actually solves what is called the twin paradox. So if I am staying on earth and if you're moving in a spaceship, then you will move faster and faster. So what I will see is a tick over here and a talk so late that when you come back, I have grown, I have grown older. My hairs are uh, uh, white. The reason is that from the frame of reference of mine, the talk is happening much, much later. So time has actually passed by and that is what is called a time dilation. But the person or you who is in the spaceship, their time runs perfectly well.